completed my plus two in 2013, but I want to continue my education. Is there any possibilities <clears throat> regarding my education gap till now? People can have uh, gaps for various reasons. Uh, uh, I had a gap of what I last did. Uh, so I had a very, very long gap, almost 20 years before I went back and did my uh, graduate certificate in New Zealand immigration advice, which is what allowed me to uh, get my license to practice as a licensed immigration advisor. But uh, yeah, gaps are, I mean, gaps are fine. There's no real problem as such with the gap. Uh, but what have you done after that? And I think what a visa officer assessing your application is more interested in seeing. Are you a genuine student? It's not so you had a gap. So that's it. That's the fact. Uh, but what have you done during that gap period? Have you worked? Have you been picking up some uh, experience? Have you done something else? So we will need to assess that. And uh, once we assess that is when we can tell you whether you are uh, somebody who can have a, a reasonably uh, successful attempt at applying for a student visa. But like I said, gaps are not a problem. Uh, we, we work with a lot of, lot of clients who have had big, massive gaps. One of my clients was 50 plus and uh, she had not, uh, uh, been in a classroom for more than 25 years, but she came as a student and uh, uh, finished a course, found a job, and you know she and her family are now settled here in New Zealand. So gaps really are not a problem.